All right, all. So today I uh, was doing some looking around on the LiDAR and whatnot, and I'm right on the side of the road, so I'm guessing that this site is probably picked pretty good. Don't know how old it is, not on a 1900s aerial map or topo map, but I'm gonna say 1800s. I'll show you what I'm looking at here. That's the cellar hole right there, very well lined. Looks like where those little three little trees are right there is how far the house may have come out. There's walls, this stacked rock right here. So yeah, I'm gonna take a look around here. I only got a little while, see what there is, and uh, go from there. If I find anything, I'll let you know. Right, I'm showing a 26 here. Doesn't seem very big. And it's repeatable. Let's see what we got. Now I'm right on the edge of the road. So there could be a lot of trash right here. Um, my guess is how easily accessible this place is. It's had to have been dug in the past. Bricks. Square nails. What we got here? Hmm. Uh, some kind of little rivet type thing, not 100% sure. Let's see if there's anything else in the hole. Well, nothing else in the hole. So I'll put this in the bag, put this in the scrap, put the brick back in the hole, and carry on. All right, so I got a 28, 29, showing up in all directions. See what's going on right here. So this is cool, some kind of little pin. I'll clean it up and get some words off of it. It's got something written on it, looks like. Very flimsy, don't quite know what it is. Almost looks like a pair of eyeglasses, but you can see it's got a pin back. So it's cool, good find. Signal in the 40s here, sounds kind of big. Something tells me this is gonna be my first trash target. A twisted piece of metal. Looks like it's broken off there. It's rounded on this end. I wonder if it's an old spoon. Like a ladle handle or something. No, well, I don't see anything else in the hole.
carry on. All right, I got a screaming 50s tone. So let's go see what this is. Well, there's two. Could it be a spill? I don't think so. But we'll give it a shot. Flashing, that's why there's two. Uh, All right, let's go see if this is more flashing here. It's an old lid to something. Maybe an inkwell? I don't know, some kind of old lid. Just dug this up, old stove part. That's pretty cool. I don't see a date on it. American six inch, Chiswold. Pretty neat. The stove must have been right here because there's a lot of ash right here too. Something really loud right here. It's all over the place, 30s, 40s, uh, 20s and 30s. It's probably iron bouncing off all the rocks in here. But, you know, so far, it's been a good dig here. Let's see what we got. Yeah. It's another piece of this metal. I have no idea what that is. Some kind of trim. Let's see what's over here. Now. Squaring out. I got a signal here. I'm up on top of this wall um, above the cellar hole. A lot of rocks in here, but it's coming up good, pretty consistent in the 20s <clears throat> under the rocks. So, let's see what I got to dig. I'm guessing it's an iron wedge. It's got a point. That I don't know. Nothing else down there. So I just picked up this. Looks like the tip of an old scythe. Pretty cool. There's an old barrel stave. So this little area I've been working in is uh Definitely an old home site, I'm guessing 1800s. Uh, like I said, I didn't see it on a 1900s map. Um, some cool little relics pulled out of here. A lot of uh, stuff in the ground, a lot of noisy stuff. So I'm just, uh, my Bluetooth speakers need to recharge a little bit. I got about another 25 minutes or so. So I'm gonna give them 10 minutes and then do another 10 minute walk around and see what I can find. It's a pretty cool site. I actually gotta come here with a camera, probably in the winter. Probably looks amazing.
I got a mid 30s tone here. Seems pretty consistent. It's really the first one in the mid 30s that was consistent that I've had. So hopefully it'll yield something decent. And it gives me a bottle cap. Another mid 30s tone. And, oh, it's like a top of an old toothpaste tube. That's pretty cool. All right, this has a loud signal in all directions, so let's dig it up. <clears throat> a lot of rocks. What's that? Something around with a shank? I got a button. I'll tell you what it is. An old flat button. It's got a good shank. Awesome. That's a keeper. Right there. Nice little flat button. That's a keeper. Nothing on it. Awesome find. Right here in what looks like the, the pathway to the ha uh, home site. Actually, I think, I'm in, I think I'm in the foundation of the home site right now. This almost looks like the threshold right here. Drink it for the box. Another consistent high 20s, low 30s signal here. Uh, once again in the ash. One of another big piece of the uh, stove. Big iron ring. Well, I got no battery left in my earphones. Got no battery left in my thing. My alarm's going off. Time to go. One last dig. And it's a giant piece of iron. <laughs> Big piece of iron. This was a good day. I had a good time at this place. I'm happy with what I found. I'll recap later on. When I have some batteries, I'll talk to you later.